Yeah. You do actually need fitness kit. Pretty good spread for breakfast. Berries, variety cereal, granola, yogurt, and then we've got pan of chocolates and croissants in the oven. So we're not really sure what he's doing. No. What stage are we at in the cheese making? Some sort of whiskey situation going on in there, isn't there? So this sounded a lot more fun on the website where we were to go to the cheese making factory and it's actually just a cheddar museum. The cheddar cheese company is one. I think it's more idea that's what we just use it. Are we on video? Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to tell your cheese joke, Jess? Oh, okay, so, um, <laughs> hi, happy <laughs> hen Charlie, this one's for you. So, um, what does a uh, magic cheese say when it's just finished its magic trick? I don't know, what does the magic cheese say when it's just finished its magic trick? <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. I actually have one as well. Okay. Um, what is the friendliest cheese? I don't know, what is the friendliest cheese? <laughs> <laughs> Any other cheese jokes? <laughs> Anyone got a cheese joke they'd like to share? You hear about the uh, accident in the French cheese factory? <gasps> no. What happened? <laughs> Debris was everywhere. <laughs> it's quite a good one. I hadn't heard that yeah. one before. It's a less common one. Yeah, that is a less common one. I'm going to be using that one. <laughs> you look so great. <laughs> That's so scary, it's so much harder than it looks. The higher you get, the harder it gets. And I just, my whole body was shaking. I'm so glad to be down. <laughs> this is the bride, scaling the wall. Pretty good, Shah. It's like you've done it before or something. Oh, <laughs> Here you go, Charlie. Thank you. Yay. Yay. These are some of the canapes that we've been putting together for the last few hours. Kitchen is a bit of a bomb site. He's a, he's a student at Bristol University. Can we just acknowledge that for a second? How, how old does that make it? Like I don't think it's so tiny. Oh my god, I feel like a pervert. <laughs> This is the cleanup operation. We've just, well, I've decided not not to go out. So I'm quite stressed about Thursday's exam, but I so I'm just staying in and just tidying up and then going to bed. I've just arrived in Cardiff. I told Tom I was going back to London and decided to drive down and surprise him. Not very good at following the sat nav, so I definitely got lost a few times on the country roads, which terrified me. But I'm here, yay! To lead the stadium, and the other blow, Thierry, is the city goal at the Liberty Stadium. Well, it is a just score, but I yeah. hate watching football. First and foremost, I think you know. Taking a mini revision break to enjoy the outdoors. This is the view from the Tom's flat at Cardiff Bay. It's so peaceful by the water, although it's always so windy. I think this is the first time we've been down here without it being raining and wet and miserable. Just doing some scenic shots. 